Hey guys, this is FluffyFidu, and once again we're back in this world that has the lava traps and stuff. But, uh, first of all, I want to go ahead and apologize if my voice sounds weird or something. I have a little bit of a cold. And so, yeah, that's why. But what I'm going to show you this time is this. Enter here for free diamond art. Hmm, sounds fun. Oh, I died. So, that is the point of this episode, to I mean, obviously this episode is over, but that's what I'm going to be showing you in this episode. Is that trap? That is the falling floor trap, you could say. Um, yeah, I'm going to go catch. And for those of you who are observant, you can see a little bit of my actual building in this world, my main building. Just a second here, because that's where I'm, it's right next to my spawn. And, uh, so yeah, back up here. And I can show you what it looks like now. Because you don't always die from that, just sometimes, but this is what's left now. And I'm sure my stuff is right here, probably. Um, I guess I can put on that armor that I got. But it's basically just this pit that all the stuff fell in. And uh, yeah, that's the trap. And I'm going to show you what it looks like. But to do that, I'm going to have to go to a different save of this world. So I will be right back in just a second. Okay, here I am back, um, in this version, there's no sign up there for some reason, but, uh, yeah. So, let me tell you how this works. First of all, let me break the redstone wiring so it won't start, but this pressure pad is wired to, well, first of all, let me just go in. It's this pressure pad that activates it, and there's the stuff, and if you notice, it's on the floor. But uh, it's this pressure pad, it's wired all along here, the repeater right there, right there, to over here. And what's over here is that exact same thing as I had with the lava, but with water. So you see there's the same pit over here, all that stuff. And so... When the redstone goes, this will refresh the water and it will go down there and let me get out of the water. So if you come down here, this is where the water will drop, it will drop right there, and then flow past here, making that torch fall. So then, if you come down here, all the way down, that's not all the way down, you will see that I have done it sort of like a staircase going down and that's so, because that is sort of like a staircase going up and so once all of that falls it'll still end up being flat down here so yeah let's like this up a bit the water will trigger it'll break that one torch causing each of these to fall causing each of their torches to break and the rest falling and such and it will end up being flat down here now, obviously, I could have made this a lot deeper and inescapable or whatever, but I didn't really feel like it, so this is how it is. And, uh, yeah, it's just a pretty cool little trap. Uh, let's get rid of these torches. Actually, I'll just, yeah, I'll get rid of them. I'm sorry for, if you can't see, I'm gonna try and brighten the video some, but that doesn't always completely solve it. So, uh, let's get back up. I can touch it there for now. Actually, for forever, I don't really care if it's on there. And, uh, now we're back up. We can go back out. I covered this up so it would look less conspicuous, I guess you could say. So that someone just, you know, walking by would necessarily know that there's a 
craft down there and uh, let's decrease the amount of time that takes cover it back up replace the redstone here and then do it again so you can take the stuff, doesn't really matter, it's going to fall anyway. And if you dig below you, you can save yourself. But even if you save yourself, you're stuck in a hole now. So, uh, yeah. That's the trap. Um, that's really... I don't know why the water just stopped right there. That sort of messed up, it's not supposed to. But, uh, yeah, that's the trap. Um, and that's all I've got for this episode. So, uh... Yeah, thanks for watching. If you have any recommendations for me to do traps or builds or whatever of, I'd be happy to do it. So leave those in the comments or whatever. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.